All right, number two, Sealsby. They were trying to remain undefeated, hosting Brazosport in front of a rowdy crowd tonight. There you see the score right there. Here's some highlights. Tigers actually found themselves down 7-0. Brazosport looking for more. It's Cameron hitting back to pass, roll to his right. Sealsby defense getting pressure. He's hit, it's picked off by Jamarian Elam. No relation to Ashley. He's gonna rumble 38 yards to the house. We are tied up at seven apiece. Exporters. They go back on offense. No one blocks Jaden Smart. He looks like uh, the Dallas Cowboys, Micah Parsons. Hidden tries to throw it deep. Triple coverage. That's picked off by Jonah Brown. What can Brown do for you? Well, he rumbles to the five yard line. That's prime field position. That's going to set up Trey Kibbles. He follows his blockers and walks into the end zone. Seals the expanser lead 14 7. Jason Torrance in at quarterback. And the exporters tonight, boy, offense just pitiful. It doesn't go well. And just like Larry Brown back in Super Bowl 30, Redrarian ball trip. Right place, right time, comes up with the interception. The quarter ends with a flip side. Silsby goes to work. Michael Mosier finds a wide open Jaden Miller. He is in for six as Silsby. They would light up the scoreboard tonight. They just wore it out. Late third quarter, Silsby leading 63-21. So it, you know, looks like they're going to go ahead and roll to another victory. Guess what? Next week, they're going to travel to West Orange Stark to take on the Mustangs in a Friday night district opener. That is going to be a classic out there at West Orange Stark.